have some breaking news to talk about and show you a protest that did start at Foley Square in Manhattan, as you can see, is on the move. This on a May Day demonstration, but this is not necessarily a May 1st kind of day, is it? Shannon Stone live in Newscopter 7 with what's going on down there. Shannon? Yeah, no, it really isn't. This is being called the Workers Unite for Palestine, and this is labor unions and workers that, as you mentioned, started in Foley Square, and just a little while ago, thousands of them that had collected at Foley Square starting at about four o'clock took to the streets and will bring up Street Spotter 7 so that you can get an idea of where they are. They just hit Avenue of the Americas off of Church Street. But I've got to tell you, this is a very large crowd. The back end of this is just now coming out of Foley Square and it took a route that took them along the north side of City Hall Park. So you can see literally thousands of people in the street. The path that they are on now, we initially thought they might be going over the Brooklyn Bridge. Police barricaded the bridge, making sure that they didn't go that way. Now they are headed directly for the Holland Tunnel. So it is unclear at this point what their end goal is. But we are once again in the middle of rush hour with thousands of people in the street just coming up on Walker Street now, heading towards the Holland Tunnel. And of course, we will keep you updated as we see where these protesters head. But as you can see, they are flanked on either side by police and in the front and the back. So, of course, we will keep you updated as they progress around Lower Manhattan. Reporting live over Lower Manhattan, Shannon Sohn, Channel 7 Eyewitness News. All right, Shannon, thank you very much.